Good morning, guys. Welcome back. Um, despite North Korea sending another missile off, the markets are doing well, and Dow is at another record. So he's saying that, or he's saying uh, Nvidia is the biggest S and P gainer right now. So we're really stoked about that. It's up like nine nine dollars right now, and Bitcoin had a little bit of a hiccup, but it looks like it's up today. Um, but yeah. Anyways, so what's up, guys? Um, it is. 10, almost 10.30, um, I gotta do some editing and then eat some lunch and then get back to editing. Yeah, so Apple is up $2.13. The pre-orders just came out for the Apple Watch and one of my friends just ordered the Apple Watch with the cellular on it. And I plan on getting it eventually once I can afford it. Um, but I think I think pre-orders might be doing well because Apple's up a lot, like $2 in one day is a lot for Apple uh, if you've been following it at all. And NVIDIA is just on fire. They got a price target increase by a firm. I'm not sure what. I got to look it up. But price target increases are always good. So hopefully, yeah. We were looking like we we're going to have a bad day this morning. But it looks like it's going to be pretty good. So, yeah, I'm excited. All right, we'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so I'm logging in right now uh, into my account. I logged in a little bit earlier and saw that we were at like about 147,000. But I haven't logged in in a while, so let's check. Oh no way! No way! No! Oh my god! Snickers! Jared, let's see if she's. Snickers. Bro, we just hit. We just hit 150k. Give me five. Give me. Give me. Oh, fine. <laughs> Get you then. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, okay, so obviously I think. I'm gonna just walk while I talk. Apple, I think, is the reason we're up today, and NVIDIA. NVIDIA is up so much money, so let's see at the top of our list. Yeah, NVIDIA and Apple are our number one and two. 19% for NVIDIA, and then our Apple call, the 200 strike, is up 8%, but we also have this one that's up about 20%. That's the 180 strike, and we have till January for that one, so that's a good one. Uh, yeah, let's see if any of them are down. Yeah, we got a couple that are that are down. Home Depot, Apple. I saw Equifax was down four dollars today, so that that means our put should be up. Yep, right there. So yep, that's what you get for sucking. And yeah, okay, wow, okay, I gotta get some editing done, and we'll come back and check when the market around when the market closes, or if something else big happens. So what's up, we're back. I'm watching uh, Ali's World of Finance. He's live streaming right now, so what up? Big shout out to him. If you haven't seen his channel, check it out. That's the channel right there. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, sorry, Ali, I'm going to lower your volume a little bit. But yeah, I want to give him a shout out because he's a really cool YouTuber. Um, he posts a lot, and so you guys should check out his channel if you have some time. And let's see how we did today because it is... Alright, I apologize again. My camera keeps running out of storage. My phone, so... Anyways, the market's closed now. Uh, it's 3.45 p.m., so let's see how we did. All right, man. So we had dropped down to like 149,000, like maybe around like 130-ish or something like that, or one o'clock, but then we came right back, finished the day super strong, so stoked. Kind of interesting that we finished at an even dollar amount. That doesn't really happen very often. Anyways, um, let's look at the percentages. Obviously, man of the hour today was NVIDIA. We just cleaned up with them, did very well up 24% on this call, and I wish I owned more calls for NVIDIA, but it's just this, this is this is the only one I own. I got seven of them, but still, I wish I had more. Anyways, we got Apple, they had a great day today too, and then Tesla, so we had a, you know, one of my top three favorite stocks of all time, and the top three. And then Equifax, because they suck at life right now, we made some money on them because their stock went down, so that was pretty cool. And then we got some other ones here. AMD had a pretty good day as well, so really excited about that, although I only have one call with them, so it's not like I'm making goo dollars, it's just whatever, I need. I should have bought more, but I didn't have the money at the time. Anyways, let's look at the ones that we lost money on, uh, Home Depot, not a good day for them, but really not really bad performances on anything else, so overall it's just a phenomenal day. Let's go with the, the dollar amount, so we can see how much we made, just shy of five grand, so I'll take that any day of the week. Super excited about that, and uh, let's look at the watch list. We got Blue Apron was the top performer today, so that was not something you see every day. Um, we got Domino's Pizza. I, I can't remember if I'm in Domino's Pizza right now. I am not. Dosh, darn it. So, oh well. So let's just look at some other ones here. We got 
Second page, Apple's on the second page, $1.60. That's a really big gain for them. If you guys are familiar with Apple's stock movements, they don't really move that much in any given day. So a dollar, anything over a dollar for Apple is a good day. So $1.60 is really good. They were up over $2 at one point. Here are the rest of the pages. And let's go back to page one to see NVIDIA again. Um, they were our number two performer here on our list. $10.71. That's phenomenal. And then Nintendo is at an all-time high, I believe, too. So that is really cool. Um, that's what Ali's, was, Ali's the World of Finance was talking about. He's still live streaming, so I'm going to go back to the live stream as soon as I'm done uh, with this. And just say, if, say what's up again, and then before I leave. But yeah, let's talk about NVIDIA. Alright, so NVIDIA. Um, so they had their price target raised again by a uh, firm Evercore ISI. Never heard of them, but just read about them today. And they raised their price target to $250, which they said is 25% higher than the next highest price target someone else has. The price target is two, yeah, 250 I just said that. But it represents like a 39 to 40% increase in what the stock is right now. So if that happened, whew, we, that would be amazing. We would, I mean, we would make a lot of money with our options. Hopefully I can get some more, but I don't, I need to move money around to do that. But anyways, that would be really, really nice. I'm really excited for that. I hope that they can do that. They said that people are underestimating the virtual reality, and I think that's true. I think the more people use it, the more people are going to want it. Um, but anyways, you've heard me say all that before, so um, let's just wrap up the video so it's not too long. Happy Friday. Hope you guys like this video. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and share with your friends if, you want, if they want to see how it is day-to-day -day trading. You can see my good days and my bad days, and I do have a lot of bad days, um, and you guys will see all of it. So with that said, hope you guys have a fantastic weekend, and we will see you on Monday. Oh, one last thing, I'm gonna be battling a Mewtwo today. I got an invitation. I was one of the lucky people to get one. I know probably 90% of you don't even care about this, but I'm gonna be battling a Mewtwo uh, in two hours. And so I don't know if I'll vlog any of it because I don't think anyone cares, but uh, I'll post a couple screenshots maybe in case any of you do care. But I'm just really stoked about that. I'm kind of geeking out about it. Anyways, have a great weekend. We'll see you Monday.